hello and welcome to my video and in this video i'll show you how to use Croppy library to add image cropping feature in your web application we are not going to in, uh, include any php or laravel library this is this is just a javascript library and yes you can upload image through this library i'll show you a step by step process and you can use either php or laravel so in this video i'm going to use laravel but this can be done with core php as well okay so in this video i'll show you this example uh, i have uploaded a bigger picture and on the left hand side we have laptop right hand side we have two cats and you can choose any of the portion of the image and you can upload uh, this image um, on your server okay so how this can be done right i'll show you First of all, in the Laravel project, I will create a route to show a form something like this. Okay, so this form will open up the controller and inside the controller it will go to create method. So in the in the product controller, we have to make a create method and in the create method will show a simple view, which is the create view and in the create dot blade dot PHP file, we will add um, a croppy CSS file and JavaScript file and we have croppy JavaScript file okay so this is the library which is responsible for cropping the image and making it a uh, base 64 image to upload using PHP or Laravel next what we will do is we will uh, make a form to um, show the image so this is a simple form in which it is the uh, in which I have used method post action is product and uh, this will actually be um, store and then uh, we have a ENC type which is multi part form data in this we have CSRF token which is required for every post request by default in Laravel next we have um, file uploading input and then we have an image preview we have a hidden base 64 image which will be used to generate the cropped image and we have a simple upload button next what we will do is that um, we will make a script and a document.ready function inside the function we will tell the croppy library to make a 400 by 400 square image um, based on the image we upload and then we will write this code as soon as we upload the image it will do the rest of the things you can just copy and paste this in your project next when we when we click and submit the form it will generate the base 64 image and add inside this base 64 image input so let's change this to store and then when i will submit the form it will go to store action so i need to create um store method as well in the store method it will open up the product controller inside the controller we have we must have a store method right so let's create one and in this product controller we will make up store method this is the base 64 image which we will be, which we will receive from the form and then these are the methods to convert the base 64 image to a real image and this is the name of the file and um, it will be saved on inside this upload folder with the name of the file um, so this is the function to um, add um, the image content inside the image file and just show the image um, path in your web application so i'll save the files and let's do a test how it works so um let's upload an image click here and select this image we have this uh, cat image and i just want to upload and i just want to ignore the laptop i just want to upload the image of two cats so these are two cats i will click upload and this is uploaded in uh, to this location so let's see in my vs code if i have any file um here um public uploads yes i have one so this is the file which we just uploaded using a web app so um, we use croppy feature uh, croppy library to do that so next what i'll do is that i'll go back refresh the page 
and then I'm gonna upload it again this time I will choose laptop and this is a laptop and I click, uh, click upload so if I see here we have an image for laptop as well so inside the inside this croppy uh, library there are a couple of things which you can change I will put this this code uh, inside the video description so that you just copy and paste from there so let's say you are making a banner for your website so you will change it to 800 by 400 and save it change this to um, 810 by 410 so this 10 is the border of the um, image preview save it and then go there uh, go back to the form uh, to create form and see that we have this um, banner website banner for your website so I upload any image here and it I can make the banner for the website something like that so this is really very amazing another thing is that um, we can also enable the resize feature so currently the resize uh, enable resize is false I can make it true and save it and see the magic so refresh the page so now I have option to change the dimension um, of the image as well so let's so let's say I want to upload a narrow banner I can do something like this and uh, upload so let's see which image do we have we have this image so you don't need to import any PHP or Laravel library you can just do it with simple javascript and jquery files so i hope this was helpful for you and in future projects you can use this javascript library to add the crop feature in your website thanks for watching my video i'll see you next time